Hey everybody, welcome back. It is, what is today? Wednesday, June 14th. I knew that actually. And it is six o'clock in the evening and I have an unboxing. Unfortunately, my scissors are, So this is from the Starlight Stitchery, and they are sold out of this one, but I figure if you guys like what's inside, you could order a future box. But this is the Pirates Mystery Box. So it just came. We're gonna have a visitor. Hi. Say hello to everybody, your cute little dinosaur outfit. Okay, so the box just has paper. I'm going to try not to look at anything and just. So this box was 165, I think. It's this cute little wax seal. Oops, and some stuff fell out. So I'll just grab what fell out. First we have a Polite Menace sticker. And the Pirate Stitch Box sticker. We have a cool little pirate coin. Says, I'm a man of fortune and must seek my fortune. We got a needle minder by World of a String. Yeah? This is plastic, I think. Looks 3D printed, actually. And then we got some tea. We got a decaf comfort blend black by Plum Deluxe. Yes. I don't have a lot of decaffeinated teas. The wax seal fell off, so I'm going to make sure that stays out of somebody's hands. You know, he's got some goldfish to keep him occupied. And we have the list of everything that's on there. I'm assuming that's what that is. So I just put it away. And then we got the Pirates Stitch Box. This might have everything that's included. Okay, no, this is the book of patterns. So we'll see that in a second. We also got <laughs> some wax melts, which are Polite Menace as well, but they're really pretty blue and sparkly. They're white with blue sparkles. It doesn't say... And it is biodegradable glitter, so that's good. This is Fox Glove and Rue, and it smells like... It smells really good. I'm really bad at figuring out smells. Okay. Thank you. Let me show this really quick. He grabbed my golden sand fabric. So you could choose between even weave or Ada. Nope, you can't have that. No, you can't have that either. Uh -oh. But it's this really pretty uh -oh. golden uh -oh. brown color. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Hold something else out that fell on the floor. So this is this little bag. Oh, cute. So these are flosses from Forbidden Fiber Co. Yeah, skull and crossbones. 
Brittany, no, sorry, Briny Deep. Pieces of Eight. Jolly Roger. And No Quarter. Then the last thing in here is an authentic print of a dictionary page, which has a cool pirate ship painting on it. Or a ship, I guess it's not technically a pirate ship since I don't see a Jolly Roger flying. And then, so I believe it said there's 13 patterns. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 12 patterns. So I'm going to see, I'm going to have to look in here to see if, that's pretty though, if I can show you, ooh, I really like this one. I was gonna say, so I can see if I can actually show you the pictures, if it has pictures. So this is my first Starlight Stitchery box. So we have the Black Pearl by the Witchy Stitcher. Love that one. And then we have What Lies Beneath. And it says, by the Stitch Sprout, it says, the sea speaks more honestly to those willing to drown. That's cool. So the reason I decided to get this pirate box is because I do a summer themed mantle for, um, for summer. All right, this one does have the pattern on the other side. If you had fought like a man, you needn't be hanged like a dog. And it's hanged like a dog by Pixel Pixie Cross Stitch. Next up is Captain Polly by Fine Frog Stitching. This one's really cool too. I could see myself doing this one. So far, I could actually see myself doing all of these. Then we have Pirate Quaker by Bendy Stitchy. I could even do this one. I'm not a Quaker person, but this one's cute. Next up is The Dancing Molly by Urban Stitches. This one I probably won't do, but it's an interesting take on it. It's a pirate dirigible. Next up is Treasure Map by Cobweb and Rose. I definitely will do this one. It says, spin me a yarn of the briny sea of pirates, treasure, and Davy Jones keep. Does it even have an X on it? I don't think it does. I would have to add an X on there. After all, what's a treasure map without an X to mark? Oh, there is. Okay. right down there but I would do it a brighter red in the pattern it's a very bright red well, not very bright but it's bright we got Captain Seaposs by Mama Witch Cross Stitch not one I will end up doing I do like the skeleton though he's cool Ooh, I love this one. 
definitely will be doing this one. This one is Ghost Ship by Noctiflora Designs. This is Sailing Above the Ghostly Sea. That's my favorite so far. This is cool too. This is Defender of the Seas by the Stitchcraft. After that, we have this one's pretty Horizon Bound by Stitched Witch. Cool sunset. Amy, Amy loves toads. I got one for you. Frog Pirates by Bad Stitch. That one's actually really cute. That was the baby gate, so my son's in there doing something probably pretty naughty. Okay, and that was the last one. So... Liam, what did you just do? Child of mine. Do, 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 do. Okay, so the tea is a blend of orange and cinnamon, so that'll be really good. I love orange teas. The Pirate Ship Dictionary print is by Fresh Prince of CT. <laughs> I just got that. Fresh Prints, P-R-I-N-T-S. The Pirate Coin is by Illusionist. It's E-L-L-U-S-I-O-N-I-S-T. And the Polite Menace sticker is by the Coin, the Coin Laundry Print Shop. And then... Okay, and then the Starlight Stitchery is one that did the pirate box sticker. Yeah, it's interesting. Okay, it does say on here what's in the tea. I was going to say it's interesting. It doesn't say it, but I was a little distracted and didn't see it. So, yeah. Love everything that's in there. Definitely love the patterns, except for like one or two, and hey. I'll use all those. I'm gonna go see what that was. It sounds dangerous. So I'm gonna leave you all here and I will check in with you hopefully later. I will see you all then.